Good afternoon. You're back with Steve Davis, Wire Coaching. I'm a real estate coach. And now we're doing a half hour uh, phone consultation. And we're getting a lot accomplished. We're teaching you the do's, the don'ts, the biggest mistakes, and the biggest benefit of doing things a certain way. Uh, people I've been meeting with lately, they all seem to ask the same question. First, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Make sure you share our channel, uh, Wire TV, Wire Coaching. The question that everybody has for me, you can go to all these seminars and uh, the one thing that nobody really, really talks about that makes everybody uncomfortable, there's a lot of discomfort here, is how to talk to buyers and sellers. I've found the best way is to be truthful. Maybe I'm a new wholesaler. Maybe I'm trying to make a few dollars. Maybe I don't know everything that I'm doing or supposed to do. So I'm up front. I'm a wholesaler. I represent people who buy houses in your neighborhood. I'm not saying I'm an investor. I'm not saying they're gonna buy your house. I represent investors who buy houses in your area. What I'm saying is I may not buy it. What I'm saying is they may not want it. I represent a group of investors who buy real estate in your area. That should take all of the uh, uh, anxiety away. You're being truthful. I'm not sure what's gonna happen with your house. I represent them. I'm not saying I'm gonna buy it. So what I am saying is if I come by here, I look at your house, together we can figure out a way if someone's interested in selling or buying your property. That's it. What else can it be? I'm not gonna necessarily buy it. I'm not saying they're gonna buy your house. I represent a group of investors who buy real estate in your neighborhood. Everything else is open for dialogue, it's open for conversation. Allow me to go in and take a look. I'll spread the word and see if there are people who are interested in buying your house at your price. That's all it is. What else can it be? That's how I represent myself when I'm going to look at a property. So. Now, I am an investor, so I can always tell people, I buy real estate like yours. Or I can say, hey, I represent a group of investors along with myself and we buy real estate and we would like to look at your house and see if there's some interest. I'm not sure what they're gonna do. I'm not sure how much they're gonna pay for it. But here's what I can say. They do buy real estate. So with that in mind, we're driving around, we're looking at houses. now. While I'm looking at houses, I'm gonna share one more thing with you. How do you talk to people who may want to invest in the real estate? Other potential investors? Well, it's the same thing, I just reversed my spill. Look, I run across people who have houses for sale. I'm not sure what price, what area, what condition, but I do get leads. What I like to know is what exactly it is that you're looking for, so if I run across it, I can share it with you and maybe there's a chance you can buy it. And if it's something that my seller is interested in, I'll add my fee on to it and we'll all make some money. There's nothing wrong with adding your referral fee, your cash locator fee, bird dog fee, assignment fee, wholesaling fee. You add it on as long as it all makes sense and everybody makes some money, you keep moving. I call it cutting up the pie. Have a good day. Oh, 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 oh,